It's good that I slept well, and now I feel good. I have to go to school today, and so I kind of took all my stuff, so. And it's already time to go. I have to ask if my mom will take me to school. That would be nice. So I gotta find her while there's still time. Hey, Mom, can you take me to school? Come on, let's go! What? What are you talking about? I don't know what you want. What? Are you okay? I have to go to school and I thought you could take me. What? What school? I graduated a long time ago. Listen, go get another bottle for Mom. I want another drink. I can't drink enough. I don't understand you. I'm sorry. At least something... Well, I'll leave you to it. Good luck and have a good day. And don't forget to buy me a drink. I don't have enough left. I want more. Yeah, I will. Ah, what a wonderful dream I had. But I got up and I have nothing to do. I think it's time to play on the computer. Good thing I have so many days off and I don't have to go anywhere. I have such a cool computer. It can pull all the new stuff and it looks really nice and it boots up almost instantly. But wait, now it's the first of the month, which means I have to run to school today is the first day. I hope my dad's still home and can give me a ride to school. It's a long walk and maybe he'll give me some money for the buffet. Yes, yes, yes. Buy all the shares. I guarantee guarantee they will pay off in a week. It's worth it. It's not a big investment, but it will pay off big time. Hey, Dad, it's my first day of school. Wait, I'm busy right now. I'll get my clients to buy my shares. Can you give me a ride and some money? Why? I'll give you some money, but my employee will drive you to school. Wow, it'd be cool if I had the money. Too bad you can't take me. I'm very busy right now, so please don't distract me. I was hoping we'd go to school together on the first day. Yeah, but I'm in the middle of a big deal, so hold the money and the driver's waiting by the car. But thanks for the money. You're welcome. I'll buy myself something nice. Good luck on your first day of school. Yes, thanks. I'll be sure to bring good grades and good luck with your big deals. I guess my dad won't give me a ride. At least his employee will. So there's nothing to be afraid of. Wow, cool car. Well, 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 who do we have here? It's me, JJ. It's my first day of school. My dad said you'd drive me. JJ, your dad told me it's your first day of school, so you're going first class. Wow, you're taking me first class on the first day of my school? Cool. Sure, let's go. Yay. Good thing it's a clearance day, and there's hardly any traffic on the road, so we can get there real quick. Yeah, that sounds good. I don't want to be late for class on my first day of school. I guess then I'll always be thought of as a slacker who can't be on time when I need to be. And we're almost there. Wow, that was fast. Just a few more meters to go. And you'll be at your school, and you still have plenty of time. Wow, what a cool school. I hope I will make cool friends here and learn a lot of cool things to make a lot of money and be immensely rich. I think I should go. But first, I have to thank the drive. Thanks for the ride. Yeah, sure. Call me if you need a pickup. Dad said if you get Fs, I won't take you home. <laughs> Dad didn't say that. I'm hoping to find some smart guy who can help me with my homework and help me with my assignments so I can ask him for help. Wow. Well, this school looks so-so. I thought it would be a little richer. They should renovate the building and make it more spacious. Like and subscribe. Hmm, I think that's what everyone should do right now because it will help me live a richer and happier life in the future. Well, it looks like everyone's in class. I gotta sneak in. I hope the teacher's not there. It'll be a fiasco. Oh, she's not here yet. That's lucky. I have to figure out where to sit. I don't know anyone here. It would be uncomfortable to sit with someone I don't even know. Or if... Oh, you're new. Yeah, my name's JJ. JJ? Yeah, that's me. Good to see you. Me too. Good thing you found your own place to go. Sit with Mikey. Okay, I'm gonna sit with him. I think you'll get along, so it's time for class to start. Well, I won't keep you. It's nice to meet you. Hi, kids. Hi, JJ. My name is Mikey. I hope you two get along and don't make any noise and interfere with the lesson. Of course we won't. Sure. I'm glad to hear that, so let's get started. Hey, we're gonna do a quiz to see who learned what over the summer. Wow, she's very picky. Yes, it is. So hi, my name is JJ. Nice to meet you. Hi, JJ. My name's Mikey. Nice to meet you. You too. Mikey, hope we can be friends. Yeah, sure, why not? I'm always happy to make new friends. And so children, as I said now, I have prepared a test for you to evaluate your knowledge and see who learned what. I hope the test isn't too hard. I've been playing all the time and haven't prepared anything for school. Yeah, I'm sure it'll be easy. Moments later. I got terrible grades. If I show this to my dad, he won't be happy and he'll stop giving me money. I have to figure out how I can solve this because it's just awful. I have to find Mikey to ask if his grades are good or not. Oh, there he is. If he's okay with it, I should ask him to help me study. Wow, he seems to have solved it perfectly. I'll have to ask him how he did it. If I could learn to solve problems the same way, that would be really cool. Hey, JJ. What? We heard you got a two. And what? You're a fool. That's not true. You can't even solve a simple test. I just wasn't ready for him. You're a fool. 
fool. Ha 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 ha. But I'm rich. Yeah, 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 cool. I'll get a tutor and he'll teach me and I'll solve better than all of you. Poor fools. I should go to Mikey and ask him how he solved all these problems. Hey, 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 Mikey. Hey, JJ, what's up? I see you easily solve these tests. Cool, but I passed them badly. Yeah, I decided okay, but you didn't. That's too bad. Can you help me understand how to solve them? Of course we can go to my house and I'll explain everything. You would help me a lot. It's no problem. Come to my house. I'll help you. Cool. Where do you live? Don't worry. I live close by, so it won't take long time. I'll have to get home later. I don't want to be home too late. Nah, this won't take long time. I hope so, cool school, but it sure looks a little different than I expected. Well, here we are at my house. Wow, that was fast. I told you it's not a long walk. Wow, is this your house? Yes, it is. It looks weird. As it is. Unusual, I'd say. Well, it's my house as it is, so welcome. Well, I guess it's okay. It's a cool house. I hope my parents aren't home, but I like my house. Interesting, really. What are you talking about? Well, your house looks like this, you know. Like what? Not so much. I don't really want to go inside such a creepy house. You're funny. Don't worry. It's not scary. Well, if you say so. I don't have spiders and skeletons and stuff to scare you. And I live here, so it's fine. Wow. About the spiders, there's a lot of spider webs. Hey, who the, uh, who's that? Oh, oh, no. Don't mind my mom. She's not in the spirit today. Okay. Well, whatever. It smells weird in here. What? Don't you smell something weird? I don't feel anything. I don't feel good. It's fine. Mikey, your place is really weird. There are branches and leaves and cobwebs everywhere. And it smells really weird. I don't really like it at your place. It's okay. I'm studying on the floor here. Maybe we should go to my place and study there? But I've always studied here on the floor. And I seemed to pass the test okay. My place would be better. Come on, we're already at my place. Let me help you. No, I'm sorry, Mikey. But why? But I don't like it here. But you need help. I'd rather go back to my place and look on the internet to study. I can help you too. It smells awful and the house looks scary, so I don't want to be here. Well, when can we get back together? I'll meet you tomorrow at school and we can go for a walk together if you want. Fine. Bye. See you later. Bye-bye. Good luck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good luck. Wow, he has such a weird house. He looks awful. I hope he's not offended. I want to get home soon. I'm finally in my normal house and not Mikey's stinking hole. I mean his house, not what you might think. I don't think my dad will be happy with the results of my grades because my test score is the worst. Friends, are you afraid to show bad grades to your parents? Write about it in the comments. Okay, time to go to daddy. Hey, hello dad. How you doing? I'm back from school. I'm ordering you to sell this stock now. Oh, hey JJ, I'm doing great. How are you doing at school? Um, my high school was great. Nothing interesting at all. Okay, I hope you are doing very well in your studies. Basically the same as always. Yeah, you're right. By the way, I have a surprise for you. A uh, surprise? I like surprises. What have you got for me? Go to your room and you will be extremely surprised. Ha ha ha. Uh, okay. I hope it's something cool. Wow. What? The new PlayStation 5 and the new iPhone 20? Awesome. Dad, it costs a lot of money. Didn't you feel bad about the money for all that stuff? Of course not. JJ, I wouldn't spare anything for my favorite son. Wow, Dad, you're the best. Thank you, son. I love you. By the way, I have to go to my job right away. I'll be right back. Okay, Dad. Thanks again for all these gifts. It's really cool. Bye-bye. I still can't believe it. I'm the coolest kid in the world, and I don't care that I have such a bad test. Daddy loves me not because of my grades in school. I think it's time to go to school and show off my cool new phone to everyone. Friends, would you like a phone like this? Write about it in the comments. I'm pretty sure no one has all that. Ha 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 ha. The next day. Day. Hello again, everyone. There's a whole bunch of my fans gathered around me, and all because of my new iPhone. JJ, do you really have a new 17 iPhone? Yes, there he is in my hands. You can only dream of it. Ha ha, you're so cool. Can I hold that new iPhone? No, that's my iPhone. No one's allowed to touch it. You're so cool, JJ. I want to be friends with you. I don't need new friends at all. You can only envy me. Someday I'll have one of these iPhones, too. Oh, what's going on here? My dad got me a new iPhone. You don't even have a phone. Oh, that sounded kind of hurtful you know. I mean, I have a poor family. Hey, Mikey, where'd you go? Aren't you happy for me? Nobody cares about Mikey. Tell us more about your iPhone. That iPhone is so expensive and cool. It's also nice to hold. Looks like JJ has made some new friends. He doesn't need me anymore. No one in this world needs me at all. JJ, let's go to your house and hang out. Uh, what? Who are you to invite you to my house? Go away, you scum. I don't need you at all. JJ, we're your new friends. Don't leave us. You're not my friends. Fine, we don't need you anymore. Go cuddle
battle with poor Stinky Mikey again, loser! You're the losers! Without a new iPhone! I'm rich and cool! Oh, looks like Mikey's got a grudge. I should make up with him. JJ doesn't seem to consider me a friend at all! Hey, Mikey, what's the matter with you? Why are you so sad? I actually got a new phone. It's all unfair! You have a new iPhone, a nice and rich family, and I have nothing! It's not fair at all! You also don't need a poor friend like me! Actually, that's not true! You're my friend, Mikey! I respect you and appreciate you, even when you don't have any money! I don't believe you! You can have that iPhone if you want it, just please don't be sad anymore! Uh, are you serious? It's a very expensive gift, you know? I wouldn't spare anything for my best friend, buddy! This phone is worthless to me, unlike you, Mikey! Wow, thank you so much, JJ! This will be my first phone ever! Anything for you, Mikey! Haha! -ha. I was beginning to think you'd forgotten me completely when you started and talking to those stupid classmates. I don't need anyone except you. Hey everyone! Mikey and I had a short day of school today, so we'll be heading home now. Oh, how I love days like this when I don't have to sit studying until the evening. Yeah! Let's get out of here soon, JJ. That's right, because now they'll keep us at school for a long time and we'll leave late as usual. Yeah, it's happened more than once. That's why we gotta get out of here. Let's go! Wait, this is important information for everyone. Yes, indeed, you can't miss it. That's homework for all of us watching this. You might want to hold off for that. It's true. Thanks for showing me. But now it's time to go. Everyone's already memorized it. That's right. All the more reason I'm excited to drive my fancy sports car. You're great, but I can only ride my bike so far. You're sure to earn yourself one of these. I don't doubt you. Just as beautiful and powerful. My bike is worse, but it's good exercise. It's true, but a car is better. I think so, too. I think soon we'll be able to drive cars together. It's true. The two of us can still conquer the world. Even though it's more comfortable to ride in a car. But look how I look from the outside side on this beautiful transportation. Yeah, Mikey. It doesn't look as cool as you think. Let's go home already. I'm looking forward to a longer vacation. Go ahead, JJ. Put it in first gear and race home. I love this car so much. She's super fast. Yeah, I won't be able to get away that fast, but I have great motivation to become successful. We'll get home slowly. So here I am. It didn't take long. My legs are well pumped from cycling. It's probably much nicer and faster to drive a car. But a bike has a lot of perks, too. Not everyone has the opportunity to drive a car. Well, it's time to go home. Home sweet home, how glad I am to be here. Especially after school. It's a pleasure to come here. Now the only thing left to do was to reach my room and lie down. Happiness is enormous. Let's hurry up. Where do you think you're going? In a hurry to get to your room? Yeah, well, I thought I'd go and lie in my room for a while. Are you that tired? Why is the house so messy? Aren't you ashamed of yourself for not cleaning up? You don't want to help out around the house at all, lazy bones. Well, I just got home from school. When would I have time to clean up? I'll get some rest, and then I'll do it. It's not a problem. I don't care where you've been. Grab a mop and go clean the apartment. And don't you dare argue with your mother. Look how dirty it is here, don't you think? You'll rest when you're done. Well, Mom, that's not fair. Okay, I'm gonna clean up now. You're very mean to me. You might as well give me some time. I don't see any problem with that. And all you do is yell and curse at me, not even listening at all. Stop talking and make a cheerful face. You're living too well. Yeah, it's too good. One pleasure to drive and not think about anything but the road. I love such moments. Thank you so much to the parents for this opportunity. In the future, I will definitely earn a lot of money and help my mom. But for now, I'm just excited. Here I am outside my house. What do you guys think? Would you like to live like this? Give me a like if you buy a house like this in the future. And be sure to post in the comments what you think of my car. Okay, that's it. We can go home now. I'm a little tired from the road. At least just lie on the bed for a while and then we'll think about it from there. There's my mom. She's doing something. Oh, JJ, you're back from school. Yeah, I'm already done. Is everything all right? How do you like the car? Did you have a good trip? Of course, mom. It's a dream car. No other way. I'm so glad. But I have one more surprise for you. Are you ready to find out? Always ready. What kind of surprise did you have in store? Come on, I'll show you. You've been asking me for it for a long time, so I got you one. Is that the new console? I can't hide anything from you. You're right. Now you have a new game console. You can use it all you want. Wow, but it's so expensive and there are so few of it around the world. Thank you so much, Mom. I'm so glad. That's great, but that's not all. Keep some more pocket money. 
spend it however you want. It's like a fairy tale, isn't it? You're the best mom ever. Thank you so much. I never have any pity for my son. Take advantage of everything. If you run out of money, you can come up and ask for more at any time. Thank you so much. I love you so incredibly hard. I'm going to go to my room to rest. And you do whatever you want. Okay, then I'll call Mikey and ask him to come over and play consoles with me. Mikey will be happy to always play the console. It's more fun with two, especially since he had never seen one before. How lucky I am to have a mom like that. I'm the luckiest kid in the world. I am very happy with everything my mom does for me. Now we need to call him and invite him over. He won't say no when he finds out what I've got. The main thing is to keep him awake because you can't wake up to things like this. All I have to do is remember his phone number. That seems about right. Now let's make the call. The number you have reached is not in service. Looks like the little one's sleeping after all. What a bad time. Then we'll have to go to his house and pick him up. He won't mind taking a ride in my supercar. Then let's not waste any time. To play more, we need to get him out of the house faster. Good thing my car will allow me to do that. Let's go get Mikey. It's so good to be a rich guy, but beggar Mikey has no money at all. I gotta help him. Mikey told me that he lives in a very poor house made of straw and clay. How awful. I would never live in a stinking hole like that. But it's not Mikey's fault he's so poor. It's his mom's fault. She works too little and earns too low a wage. And there's Mikey's house. I'd say it's made of poop. No, it's earth. Yeah, not cool. Hey, Mikey, come out for a walk. Mikey, stop sitting at home. Let's go to my house and play Xbox. Stop sleeping, Mikey. Hey, why are you yelling? What do you want? Hello, is Mikey home? I'm JJ. He's home, but he's grounded. He's cleaning up. You came at the wrong time. Get out of here, you stupid rich boy. Huh, yeah, I'm rich and you're not. What's the rudeness? Get out or I'll call the police. The police? Why? Because you're a stupid boy who's interfering with our life. Oh my God, Mikey's mom is so strict. Friends, do you have strict parents? Write about it in the comments. But my parents are the best, kindest, and richest parents ever. I love them very much. I don't envy Mikey, of course. I wonder what Mikey's doing right now. I can't wait to see him again. Oh, God, I'm so sick of cleaning. Is that Mikey? I found him. He's really cleaning up. Hey, Mikey. Hey, it's me, JJ. Can he even hear me? Mikey, look at me. Oh, what's that sound? Oh, JJ. Hey, Mikey, stop cleaning up. Let's go to my house and play video games. Mm -hmm. Sounds like fun, but I heard your mom kicked you out of here. I don't care about her at all. I got a new console. This is the new Xbox. Oh, that's cool. I'd love to play with you. I just need to get out of here. Come on out already. Stop doing this stupid cleaning. But then what do I tell my mom? I'm grounded. I can't just leave the house. What is this? JJ, I told you to get out of here. She's a meanie. Spit in her face and get out of here. What is he even saying? I forbid you to be friends with him. Okay, mommy. And you, arrogant and stupid JJ. AJ. Hey, you're the stupid one. Get out of here. I've already called the police. But why? He didn't do anything. Shut up. Here's your broom. Sweep the whole house. Ah, uh, okay, Mom. Whatever you say. Why are you agreeing with her? Hit her over the head with that broom. You shut up. You're not in your own house to boss me around. I repeat, you are not welcome here. God, what a mean mom. I'd probably run away from home if I had a mom like that. But that's okay. I have a plan. I'm gonna sneak into this house at night and take Mikey to my place. It's not Cool to live here. <laughs> Good evening, I waited until it was dark outside and Mikey's mom was asleep. I'll just walk into their house, steal Mikey, and run away from here. Their family is so poor they can't afford to buy locks on their door. Anyone from the street could walk into their house at night. Okay, Operation Mikey Stealing is on. The most important thing is not to scream in here lest you wake up his screaming mom. Yeah, they're so poor here. Here comes this snake resting after yelling at Mikey all day. By the way, why is Mikey sleeping on the floor? Is it a family thing? They probably just don't have the money for a second bed. Poor Mikey. I feel so sorry for him. Time to wake him up. Mikey, get up! Oh, uh, what's going on? JJ, what are you doing here? I came to save you. Let's go to my house. You're suggesting I run away from home. It'll all work out. Don't be afraid. Your mom's still asleep. Uh, I'll have to make sure of that. Oh, yeah, she's asleep. That's good. I hate her so much. She's taking full advantage of you. Yeah, I agree with you. I hate my mom. Let's go to your house and play the cool Xbox. Let's go, Mikey. Just don't make too much noise. In general, I think it's right to run away from home. 
home if your mom makes you clean the house. In fact, I agree with you. The child is the most important person in the family. Yeah, no one's gonna boss us around now. Let's go to my house in my Ferrari. A uh, Ferrari's not cool. Lamborghini's a good looking car. Ha 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 Mikey. And you try to buy at least one of these cars. Mikey! Oh my god, your mom's awake. Where do you think you're going? You two stupid little kids. JJ, we gotta run to your car. Hurry up, otherwise she'll beat us both. I'm gonna kick your butts. Oh my god, not that way. That's too tender a place for me. Where are you going? Give me my son back. I'll punish you all. JJ, gas on the floor. Drive as fast as you can. I memorized your numbers. I'll find you, JJ. You'll never get away from me. Ah, oh, we got away from her. That mom's not as fast as my cool Ferrari. You're gonna live here now, Mikey. All thanks to this wonderful car. I'm so glad I won't be living with that stupid mom anymore. Now you're going to live with my good mom. I hope we can be friends with her. Of course you will. She's very friendly. I never have to clean house again, I hope. Nah, Mikey. Mommy cleans the house and mops the floors herself. Wow, your house is so big and rich. Yeah, I got enough money for a lot of cool stuff. You should meet my favorite mommy. Oh, okay. I hope I can stay with you guys forever. Of course you can. Now you'll be my little brother. Oh, hey, JJ. Oh, who's that with you? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hello, my name is Mikey. I'm a friend of your son's. Oh, he's so cute. That's a pretty sweet boy. I want to keep him with us. Uh, all right, we have plenty of room in the house. Let him live with us. That's it, Mikey. You're living with us now. It's cool that I have a new home. I wonder what happened to his old house. His mom kicked him out. Now he has no place to live. Apparently, your mom doesn't care about that at all. Good thing she doesn't ask a lot of questions. Mikey, stop talking. Let's go play my new game console. Sit back and have fun. Wow, that is such a soft couch. Better than your newspapers on the floor, huh? Much better. My back hurts from the cold floors in my old house. Oh, where do you have that Xbox? There he is standing right there. Wow, it's beautiful. Now we can play all the coolest games. I wonder if we can play Minecraft on it. Of course we can. I said we can play all the games. It's nice to be rich. It's not cool to be poor anymore. I hate poor people. Friends, like this video. Subscribe to our channel. Do you have a new Xbox? Write about it in the comments. Bye-bye. I'm so sick of sitting around with all these idiots. They can't even talk. Hey guys, I decided to come to school for the first time this week. There is no teacher, so we can relax and do nothing for now. You know, I'm so bored sitting here alone. It'd be nice to have some fun with someone right now. Hi kids, I have some very good news for you. There's a new kid in our class. His name is Mikey. Wow, another boring and uninteresting loser on our team? Hey everybody, I'm Mikey. I hope we can be friends with all of you. Hmm, he doesn't look like a total loser. All right, Mikey, you need to pick a seat in the classroom at your desk. So go find it quickly. But I don't know where to put you. All the seats are taken. Uh, my seat's free if you want it. If it's okay with Mikey, then fine. Come on, get in here, buddy. Finally, I'm not sitting alone. Only JJ is a bully. Don't become one. What are you waiting for? Get in here, Mikey. Okay, let's sit together then. Now I'm going to ask for silence. Lesson begins. Hey, Mikey, we'll be friends with you. The topic of today's lesson is some squares. Oh, stupid squares. That's not interesting at all. I'm in. I'm not interested in squares. Why listen to her at all? She's so stupid. Oh, yeah, Mikey, you're a cool kid. We're gonna have a lot of fun stuff together. Squares are square. Remember that? Three hours later. Finally, those stupid lessons are over. Who needs squares anyway? She talked about them for three hours. Oh, let's go home now. And don't say anything about those squares. I'm sick of them. Ha ha. Mikey, did you know your head is square too? Very funny, JJ. I wish I had a regular oval head, you know. Let's go home, square head. We're in Minecraft. There are no ovals. Square head. Hmm, just like SpongeBob square pants. Wow, you watch that cartoon too? Oh, sure. I've watched every episode of SpongeBob. He's a really cool dude. Let's go to the bus stop together. Uh, nope. There's a car waiting for me there. That picks me up from school all the time. Oh, well, okay. I'll go alone then. Okay, Mikey. By the way, there's my car. I could give you a ride home because riding buses all your life is not cool at all. Wow, I'd love to ride in a cool car like that. Then get in the car. We'll give you a ride, no problem. No, I'm a little shy. I don't know if you're uncomfortable. What are you talking about? It's not hard for me at all. You're my friend from today. Let me help you. Well, okay. 
way. Take me for a ride in your car if you insist on it. Of course I don't mind. I had to talk you into it. Hopefully I'll be allowed to drive this super expensive car. Not today. Friends, how do you get home from school? Write about it in the comments. And it's time for me to get in. Let's go. Mikey, why don't your parents pick you up from school in their car? Because I live in a very poor family. We can't afford to buy a car. Oh my God, this is really bad. I'm so sorry for you. Oh, don't apologize. Some are rich, some aren't. Here's my house. It's been a cool ride. If you need, I can give you a ride home every day, Mikey. I'm only too happy to help you. Yeah, your house isn't as cool as mine. Yeah, we can't afford to live in a proper house yet. Even the walls are made of earth. By the way, do you want to come over and visit me? We can read comics together if you don't mind. Let's go. I'll lock the car so we can get to your comic books. Although being in a house like this is such a cringe. It's okay. You'll get over it. You've lived in the midst of rich luxury all your life. Sometimes you gotta come down to earth with the regular people, you know. Come on in and don't be shy. Uh, would your parents be okay with you bringing strangers into your house? They're not here yet. Then I'm okay with it. Oh my god, this place is filthy. There's cobwebs and dirt and dust everywhere. It's awful. Oh, it's actually a pretty normal house. You're just a whiner. I'm a whiner? I don't even care what's going on around here. Let me show you my comic book collection already. You're sleeping on the floor? Are you serious? Where's your bed? I don't have it, but I do have Spider-Man comics. But there are no pictures at all. This is the wrong comic book. Oh, what's your imagination for? Imagine there are pictures and that that's it. Hey, who the hell is this guy? What is he doing in our house? Uh, I'm Mikey's friend JJ. He invited me over for a visit. We didn't allow him to bring guests here. We should punish Mikey for that. But we didn't do anything wrong. I don't care at all. He needs to get out of here as soon as possible. And why aren't you at work? Here are your flyers. You have to post them all before nightfall. What? Your son works and goes to school at the same time? You shut up. You shut up. You're terrible parents. Who can't even buy Mikey a bed? I don't want to hear anything. You have to go to work now. And you freak, get out of our house. Well, I thought my parents would be home a little later. You have so little money that you are forced to work. It's so sad. You gotta go, JJ. I got a lot to do. Okay, Mikey. If you need any help, just say the word. It's okay, JJ. I can handle this on my own. Thanks for driving me home. Bye-bye, Mikey. See you at school. Bye, JJ. I'm sorry I yelled at your parents. Friends, what do you think? Is it normal to work at this age? Write about it in the comments. And I gotta get home. I'm so upset that Mikey is living in such a bad situation and there's nothing I can do to help him. Maybe just give him some money so his parents will take it away from him. But it's still a good thing I have a much better life than Mikey. My house is way cooler than his. It's good to be rich, man. Mommy, hi, I'm home. Yes, order the cake for tomorrow. The biggest cake ever. What? What cake? Are we having a party? Oh, JJ, you're here already? Yes, I heard all about your cake. Hey, son, did you forget? It's your birthday tomorrow, so I ordered a cake. Oh. Oh, cool. I love cakes. Hey, darling, come down here. Our son's home from school. Wow. Hey, JJ, good to see you, son. Hey, Dad. Can you believe he forgot his birthday? I'm just out after school. By the way, I made friends with a new kid in my class. Then invite him to your birthday party. I'm sure it's going to be fun. Wow, that's a great idea. I'll be sure to get Mikey here tomorrow. You finally have some friends, JJ. You used to walk around sad all the time. Now you're so cheerful. All right, I'm going about my business. Good luck with your birthday preparations, JJ. Thanks, Dad, looks like Mom's busy doing her thing, too. I think I'll go play my game console since I have nothing else to do. Mikey probably can't even dream of a console like this. I've got it all to myself. Guys, do you celebrate your birthdays with your friends? Write about it in the comments. And it's time for me to play my console. Hey, everybody, it's my birthday today. You can congratulate me in the comments. I will be very pleased to read it. I'm waiting for Mikey. I want to invite him to my birthday party. Oh, there you are. Hey, Mikey, I want to tell you something. Mikey, can you hear me? Oh, hello, JJ. Come here. Something's wrong. You've been so active in calling me here. I'm inviting you to my birthday party today. Come to my house. It'll be fun. It's your birthday today? Wow, I don't have a present for you. I'll do it, but my mom told me not to talk to you. She might beat me up for it. We're not gonna tell her. Oh, okay. Except my mom asked me to go to the store to buy a lotto ticket. Then let's go right now. I don't care about lessons. What do you need those tickets for? You'll never win. I know. It's my mom who keeps asking me to buy it. Okay, we're going to my house in my cool car. 
Do you even know what the odds are that you can win the lottery? No, I don't know. Imagine the chance of a meteorite falling on you right now. That's about the same chance of winning the lottery. Here we are. Let's hurry up and buy this and then go to my house. I agree. This is the store. I'll go there. You stand here and wait for me. Lotto America. Okay, boss, I'll wait for you here. Look, why is my mom even spending money on this? Because she's stupid. We don't always have food at home, and she keeps hoping she'll win something with those tickets. Okay, that's her problem. Wait for me. I'm about to buy these useless tickets. Just go. We're late for my birthday. Oh my god, we're wasting time on total nonsense. By the way, friends, what would you buy if you won the lottery? Write about it in the comments. I'd give all the money to Mikey. He needs it more than I do. Thank you so much for the ticket. I'm never gonna win anyway. Bye-bye. You're finally here. I've been waiting for you for years. Oh, stop whining already. This is the ticket. It's done. Now we can go to your house for the super party. Let's go. It's about time. We're wasting time on the most useless things in the world. Who knows? Maybe I'll get lucky this turn. Ha ha! How naive Mikey is. There's my house. Come on in. Don't be shy. My parents are already waiting for us inside. Oh, wow. You said you were rich, but I didn't realize how much. I really like your house, JJ. You even have a pool. I hope you don't pee in it. No, of course not. Are you crazy? I always pee in the kitchen sink. Oh, okay then. Then you're a really normal person. Let's go inside already. My mom made me a huge cake. And I love cake. I never ate them, though, because my parents didn't have the money to buy it. Well, then you're in luck. Tonight, you're gonna taste it for the first time in your life. Oh, what a beautiful home you have inside and out. I would so love to live in the same house with you. Yeah, my house is really cool, but your house is nice, too. It's made of straw and mud, but that doesn't matter. Oh, JJ, where are your parents? I already want to eat some cake. There they are. Happy birthday, JJ. Happy birthday. I wish you happiness and health. Oh, yeah. Happy birthday to you, too, JJ. Thank you so much for all the congratulations. I'm so happy to see you all together. And there's your cake. You have to blow out the candles and make a wish. That's the cake you wanted so much, Mikey. You look so big from up here. I agree. It's so big. I hope it's just as tasty. By the way, meet my new friend. This is Mikey. He's a really cool dude. Blow out the candles and make a wish now. Hmm. Interesting. What could I wish for that would be so awesome? Wish me a new car. Wish me a new frying pan. Do what you think is right. I want Mikey's family to have a better life and be friends with Mikey. Who? The next day. Wow! Good morning, everyone! My last birthday went well. I hope my wish came true, but I think it's just miracles. How does blowing out candles on a cake make wishes come true? That's so crazy! But I was asked to wish for what I wanted most, and I did it! Who's that ringing the doorbell? I should open the door! Knock, 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 knock! Here I am! Hey, JJ! I got some great news! What kind of news is that? Get in here! No one's home! Remember that lottery ticket? Well, here it is. Our family won a hundred million million dollars. Now we're as rich as you are. Wow, Mikey. I'm so happy for you. Now you won't have to work after school and you'll have a new bed. You're actually going to be cooler than me now. And you said the odds of that are as low as possible. You were talking about meteorites. It did fall right on my head in the form of a lot of money. Yeah, now you can swim in coins like Scrooge McDuck. Hey, everyone. Mikey and I had a short day of school today, so we'll be heading home now. Oh, how I love days like this when I don't have to sit studying until the evening. Yeah. Let's get out of here soon, JJ. That's right, because now they'll keep us at school for a long time and we'll leave late as usual. Yeah, it's happened more than once. That's why we gotta get out of here. Let's go. Wait, this is important information for everyone. Yes, indeed, you can't miss it. That's homework for all of us watching this. You might want to hold off for that. It's true. Thanks for showing me. But now it's time to go. Everyone's already memorized it. That's right. All the more reason I'm excited to drive my fancy sports car. You're great but I can only ride my bike so far. You're sure to earn yourself one of these. I don't doubt you. Just as beautiful and powerful. My bike is worse, but it's good exercise. It's true, but a car is better. I think so, too. I think soon we'll be able to drive cars together. It's true. The two of us can still conquer the world. Even though it's more comfortable to ride in a car. But look how I look from the outside on this beautiful transportation. Yeah, Mikey. It doesn't look as cool as you think. Let's go home already. I'm looking forward to a longer vacation. Go ahead. JJ. Put it in first gear and race home. I love this car so much. She's super fast. Yeah, I won't be able to get away that fast, but I have great motivation to become successful.